<laughs> and I looked over and it looked like a white silhouette, someone like a, a white outline. It's, it's, black. it's weird because it, it felt like it felt a presence there as well. It felt like something was lingering in the corner. Right, look, Are you on, mad? On standby. Don't, don't fucking take ages to know. Right, 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 right. Did you hear the drawers? Yo! Yo! What? What? Did you hear that? That sounded like something was fudding into the room then. Right, there was something. Put light on. Put your light something. Light on. Something stomped into the room then. Turn it on. Well, I'm seeing shit. No, seriously. Turn it. Fucking thing on now, bro. Bro, I hope to God that was my imagination. Bro, this is getting big. No, 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 no. There was someone. I could see an outline of someone still at the door. See, this is what he said with the brain. With the brain. I don't know. Well, what? But I freaked out then. Alright, let's have a look inside. I am not reading all this to you. But look, the remnants of the 15th century tower, which is keyhole, gun points and barrel vent, barrel vaulted ceiling. Look at that. That's in, I don't know if you can see it still light on the paper, but that's in the main castle house. The badge of Nova, these are some of the artifacts they have. Right. That's the courtyard we're in. That's looking out of the castle. We're in this bit here. Bakehouse, we're in this bit up to there. <laughs> then there's another one. We've got the full top row of there. They're all our rooms. And then up to that door there. And I don't know what's in there. This has been converted. Then there's the big castle entrance over there. The old entrance to it, which is just sick. And then there's that house where somebody lives. And then, where that picture is taken from is in that tower. This is in the main castle. This is where he was speaking to us out of when we got here. Oh, I don't think I videoed that actually. Look at the artifacts. It's just unreal. That's the dining room, it says. Don't even know what that meant. Look at the kitchen. Wow. Wooden butter mould. That is so cool. I love things like this, guys. Chinese tea bricks. Yo, what are they for? Does anyone know what that's for? A brick. I know that's I know that's tea, tea leaf, but what's that? What's the tea brick for? Whoa, that's the staircase up inside the tower bit. That is sick. <clears throat> so number one is Sir Hector Munro Fallis, 11th Barnet, Bar 11th Baronet, 11th Barnet, cut that out. Uh, Sir Hector Munro of Fowles, ADC LL, 11th Baronet, 1848 to 1935. He was gifted this place and did it up to what it is now. Sir Charles Munro of Fowles, 9th Baronet, 1795 to 1886. Wow! So that's the that was Sir Charles Munro Fallis. Him. So he he had it the longest. Alright, he didn't have it the longest. He had it in 1795. Wow. So the names we need to look for in the paranormal tonight, guys, is going to be Sir Hector Munro Falls. Sir Charles Munro. Major Sir Charles Munro, Captain Hector Munro, killed in action 23rd of October 1918. So which one was he? Number four. He was killed in the army in the war. In 1918. So wow, that would have been World War One. Yeah. That must have been. 
succeeded her father, sir. Oh, so sir, Charles Munro was her dad. He was her dad. And she had it from 1881 to 1976. Wow, she had it quite a bit. She had it a long time. Succeeded her father, Sir Hector Munro Falls. Oh no, see. Sir Hector number one, yeah. Him. She was his daughter. Captain Patrick Munro. He was a captain. And seven, Hector W. Munro. So we need a Hector, a Patrick, another Hector. Wow, that Eva Gascoigne. Eva Gascoigne, wow. Gascoigne, I wonder if that's something to do with the famous Gascoines. And I think this is them now. Wow, so that's like... But I'm sure that's the lady that we seen, one of them. I'm sure we seen her. When we pulled in. Sure of it. Maybe not. The Chiefs of the Clan Munro. Jesus, there's something. Look at these. Died 1039. Donald Munro. No way. Uh, have you heard Carl having a red in there? This is what I've got to deal with when we're out on these trips. Carl thinking he's mixing bangers in the next room. <laughs> Bait cows, copy please do not really. Copies, copy can, copy can be purchased for five pound. I've never heard of Google, guys. Right, guys, we're gonna get on a paranormal for you. Let me just get this light off in here. So we have actually been reading some information about this place now. This is not just a castle. This has been in the Monroe's from is it? Yeah, since the 1500s. Since the 1500s. Since the 1500s. So the woman and the book you were talking to, they're actually part of the Monroe's family. You can still get a tour of the castle from descendants of the Monroe family. Well, maybe we uh, we go get one in the morning. 100%. Just to see what this place is about. I don't know, man. Huh? Nice and kind of vibes there. Only this way they would have held the prisoners though. This was the bakehouse. Yeah, the bakehouse. The prisoners will have been held in the court. Just through that door there as well, in the courtyard, there still is the very original uh, oven, bread oven. Really? Yeah. Uh, That's but, why it's shut off. Wouldn't you have had prisoners working in, in the bakehouse though? No. Yeah, but it's right next to the courtyard. So yeah, it would make sense that they was held in the courtyard and worked in the bakehouse. I don't know, I don't think they trust them to work in the bakehouse. Oh yeah, well, I don't they know. They trust them to work in the bakehouse, they keep them in the cells. I don't know though, because back in them days, you got killed if you didn't do your job. No, I don't think they would have. They'd have peasants to that. Yeah, true. They'd have had, like, peasants yeah. Peasants yeah. Especially 14th, 15th century. Yeah. Peasants would have been rife. Because mm. even that story that it said about that, that pass around the corner, it was like a mistress and a... And they're a lady, weren't it? So, wait a minute, what's the story about this hidden ginnel? That That's what I was on about then. That's that story about that woman who, she, um, the lady was taking what they used to call, like, the slaves, basically the slave, and she, next thing, something about some keys were thrown on a rock, and then she got drawn down into the water, and she was ended up, some guy found her years later in a cave that's down there with two dogs guarding her. Guess what I found before? What? Keys. A set of keys, I have no idea where they came from. And that's actually not, uh, that's actually no joke, that. How weird is that? That's weird, that, because they're in my car still. I found them in a door pocket, never seen them before. And it said, oh, do you know what it says as well, which is weird? What are them keys on? They're not on a normal key ring, are they? I don't even know. They're on a ring, like a bigger ring. And it specifically says in that thing about a ring of keys being thrown on a rock and Whoa. the the the, Im, the the imprint, the imprint... The imprint the imprint can still be seen on that rock to this day, it says. Should I get the keys out of the car? Maybe we should go and try and find this cave. Maybe we should try and find this cave. It's only around the corner. Really? 
Oh, yes, possibly. It's walking distance. The story says there's a little thin path that walks down. A guy got drew down it, um, looking for his salmon that got stolen. <laughs> you, because, no, honestly, that's what it says. He was fishing for salmon. He'd hidden some to drop some off for some locals. When he come back to pick his up to go home, they'd gone, but there was like um, a trail of fish scales, like an animal had picked them up. So he was following it to see where they went, and it led him to like um, a path down the side of that gorge that shouldn't be there. And like they say, isn't there now, no one can find it. And it was easy for him to get down and then he's seen like a cave that had two sleeping dogs outside it. This is literally what the story said. I've just been reading it. And then he goes in, um, carries on down, sees a table with some bread and his salmon on it and sees a woman chained to the cave. Whoa. Like it says, the cha it says the chains are buried in the walls, like part, like not attached, they're actually in the wall. And she's strapped to the chair and... He goes over, talks to her. She says something. She won't come out with him because of the chains. She points at the chains and supposedly the dogs have woke up and are growling at him. And then he turns around and um, and then she throws bread to dogs or something because he pulls out of whatever they have, like a knife or something like that. I can't remember what word what that he used for it. it. Well, they used a mad word for it. Um, Saber. Might have been. It was something like that. And they pulled it, he pulled it out and then she screamed at him, no, throwing bread to the dogs or something, told him to run. So he's got out and he could barely get back up the tracks. It, it had disappeared and he's like climbing up the side of the rock and that and he only just made it out. What the hell? That's the story anyway. Wait, well, that, that was not, 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 check this on the wall. What, the, what is this? What is that? Ah, these are old tapestries, aren't they? Yeah, They're not just, even pictures. Bro, just check that out. What is that? It's a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah, I can, do you know that's what yeah, they call yeah. modern art, isn't it? Or like some alien or something, like some weird head or something. I don't know. something <laughs> yeah, and it's weird how it has a butterfly over the top. Oh, yeah. oh, yo, yeah, there's an alien there, bro. What does it say? Courage, my friend. Oh, fuck. It looks like an alien. Yeah. Was that an alien head? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is, this is interesting. I'm hoping this uh, red bus can go off. Alright. Who wants to do some calling out now? I think we should do some calling out seeing this is the history of man right now. Um, I, do you know what as well I, this is how bad my memory is I've just read all the, the like the oldest names from here and forgot every single one of them. Should I just go and get the book? Yeah, yeah get the book. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> You'd love a male bitch. If you didn't get what I meant by that, you're really slow. There's there's a map in there that takes you to it. No way. Yeah. Right, where was that list of names? Here. Right, I didn't break this, it was already broke. If you find the specific names in there that relate to your bill. Right. Oh, sorry. The Monroe family date back to 1039. But they have only lived here since 1490. And 1505, William Monroe killed at summit whilst on the king's business. And he was killed by Cameron of Lochiel. The names we're looking for, though, are more. Uh, William Monroe, Hector Monroe, Robert Monroe... Robert Moore Monroe, um, yeah, um, John Monroe, another Hector, another Robert, Sir Hector, another Sir Hector, Sir Robert, Sir John, Sir Robert, they're all Sir Roberts and Johns, all, and then there's Harry, Hugh, in 1781 and 1848, and then the newer ones that are all the history in these books are about are like Charles Monroe, and then this is where it's, it's mad, Sir Charles Monroe, there's still a Sir Charles Monroe in here today. No way. Yeah, he's, he's the eagle guy, like, uh, wait. The, there's an eagle, like, it, like, basically, the Monroe Eagle is here. Whatever that is. People will know what the Monroe Eagle is. I don't, because I'm not into birds. What, it's an actual breed? It's an actual, yeah. And, and, he, and basically, it was saying in the book, 
I don't know, but he's the chairman of the entire country, it says. His name is at the top and this address. And it shows him with a big ass eagle, so I'm taking it, it's an eagle. <laughs> and it's like a little passport book for the eagles. Your record. Record. What? When we were talking about the eagles as well. See, that's, that's exactly why I want you to come out with history, mate. Because like, Still every time... Show you, I'm going to get the eagle passport. Oi, I'm not going in here in dark neither now. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Oh, that was dodgy, that. Yeah, this is exactly why I want we to read out the history, because, like, it seems like we've got locations that's right. Oh, wow. I come back with the Eagle book straight away, then. What the hell? What, why is it flashing different colours? Why is it going up? It's the, the high, higher the intensity. Intense, intense. So the higher the pitch sound... It doesn't like me having the book. The more lights there are, the colour... Right, if I pick that back up and that goes off, it doesn't like us talking about the eagle or the book. Mm. Oh, mate. That is pretty weird. Right, let's talk about the eagle then. Yeah, let's keep talking about the eagle. Right, all right then. I well, like the idea of that. Whoa, can you feel that? Feel that? Whoa! Did you ears just look at my yes. ears? Look, yeah, bro. look, I've just felt it. Look. Mate. Did you just as you said it. it. It's about, it's about did, you, did you feel that? Tell me about that. Just you said it. Did it feel like smart on that side of you? Something just walked straight through. Mate, mate, I felt that what then. The... I felt oh, that then. Right, let's look through this book because I'm sure it was in this book that there was a picture of him with his eagle. It makes me laugh, you know, like usually we, we go to locations. With, 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 with wow! Oi, it tells you everybody who has an eagle. I know, but we're actually staying here tonight. So just, actually, right now. <laughs> oh, damn it. Carl, shine your light over here, bro, so I can see in this book. I'm sure there was a picture of it in this book. In one of these books, there's a picture of him with his eagle. They're all the people that we need to be looking for. Um, the fur, the longest back on here being 1795. Oh, okay. what, what? Sir, and it's Sir Charles Monroe again. He's the one with the eagle now, but obviously descendant of him. So are you Sir Charles Monroe? Are you Charles Monroe? If you are, can you try and touch this device again? Are you Sir Hector Monroe? Or Captain Hector? There's an Eva Gos Gascoigne as well, who was who succeeded her father, Sir Hector Monroe, and this cap. Captain Patrick Munro. There was a guy as well, that Captain Hector Munro um, of Falls, 1895 to 19, uh, 1918, was killed in action on the 23rd of October 1918 in World War I. No way. Which is pretty sick. Yeah, well, wait, let's get... I'm looking for that pit, but it's weird because I've not... I've put the eagle books down and I've picked this one back up and it's stopped. It's weird, so that let me do that again. Now, if I pick that eagle book, could that goes off, I'm going to bed. <laughs> There's a picture in here of him with an eagle in one of these anyway. Um, as well, where was that? There was a picture of the family in here. Look, is that not the girl we've seen coming in? Her uh, with screwed up face. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, that's the family now. Is that, do you reckon that? Do you re no, she is screwed. Whoa! No. It doesn't like you saying that. Well, she has though. Look, look, I'm not being funny. That's, look. 
Yeah, that's her, bro. She's got a screwed up face, though, hasn't she? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not meaning it nasty. That's what she's doing in the picture. Yeah, yeah. Screw facing. <laughs> it's obviously a, a bad. This guy, it's Boy, either bad, it's either it's I'm sure it's that guy there. He's he's Sir Charles. Well, right, this, him. This is interesting. Isn't it? The old guy here, he's the one that has the eagles, and there's a picture of him. I'm sure it's in one of these books. Is that the eagle book again? One of them. This is telling you about the history of Mum Ra. There you go, there he is. With his eagle. The chief of Golden Eagle. And at the top, and it says his name in like the top of this book here. Yeah, look. Chairman, Clan Monroe, Association, Scotland, Hector W. Monroe Falls, Chief of Clan Monroe. And then Clan Monroe goes, and then the President lives in the United States. Uh, the rest of them all live in the States. Really? Yeah. The President has an eagle? No, the President of this association. Oh. And it wouldn't surprise me if he did. Why would you not? Um, so, and and the ch the only person in charge of it lives in this country. No way. Look, it's there for you all. Yeah, put it back a bit. Right. Um, see, there's only one UK person. And it's him. Who's got a golden eagle, and it shows him with it there outside the castle. Why did they not like us playing with this eagle book and talking about the eagle? I don't know, maybe we should get a spirit box on just see, see if we get anything on the spirit box. Whoa! What? Oh. Wow, I've never seen it spike like that, mate. Yeah, should we get this device on them? Yeah, he might want to talk to us. <laughs> this device in my hand enables you to talk to us. I'm going to turn it on now. What does that mean when it does that, Carl? It, well, when, it, when, it goes when it goes from the bottom to the top? It's like, just going up, going up in levels. Yeah, but it, that only flashed the bottom one, then the top one. Yeah, Didn't I flash them all. Yeah, these might be bust on it, but... Um, all right. It usually goes up in skates like bottom, top, and then the next minute will go two bottoms, and then one top, and it'll keep going up and up and up until all the lights go on. But basically, the higher the pitch, the more lights, is basically whatever's there is... It's close. ...on it, do you know what I mean? It's like absolutely on it. Twice it's done it. Did you hear it? I turned, I looked at you the first time, didn't I? And I was like, what was that? But did you, I'm glad you heard it, it was like someone going. Uh, uh. He's probably whoever's playing with that thing. Hello? Are you around us now? Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Well, that yeah, was man. clear as day. Yeah, yeah, man. That was clear as day. What's your name? Well, go on again. <laughs> 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 
it's constantly going. So if, if you're here with us now, can you try and stand right in front of us? Whoa, whoa. Oh, Rem pump. Yeah, wow, look at that, bro. It is going absolutely crazy. I just said as well if you hit it. That's me. Yeah. That's me. Oh, wow. That's that actually did. That was clear, that. And it sounded like the same voice that said, yeah, man. Yeah. Can you, can you tell your name? Did I just say Robert? Robert? Rob. Mate, no, I, thought, I thought it said Monroe. So I thought it it said might have said Monroe, isn't it? If that said Monroe, that's Brent sick. We'll have Monroe. to listen to that. Bro, so, should try EVPs. Yeah, yeah, yeah get the EVP I, on. The EVPs that I call, I, I, that's what I truly believe in. Yeah, we'll, we'll, EVPs. We'll, get, we'll get the EVP on in there, definitely. Whatever this is, this is strong. Yeah. Right, guys, it's pretty mad that I've never, I've so never been with Carl, and the REM pod's gone that mad, and I've had it sat right, right next to me. In, in, in I've been doing lives with a phone yeah, that does not interfere with kind of in this course. Set that off. No. But Carl, I was just saying that. I was just saying that to the camera. Then, remember that time when we tried that, Carl? Yeah. Where I sat next to it on a live, remember? And I got to where that before it started messing it up. And it was because I was close to it, weren't it? Oh, yeah, maxing out. Wow. I'm just... What? I'm going to keep running it. Here, hang on. Is this switched on? So, so, so did you say Mon... Mon... Run board again. Yeah, I... I thought it said, I don't like. I don't like. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So... Is it Mon it's Monroe, isn't it? Monroe. Monroe. Monroe, yeah. M-U-N-R-O. So are you, are you one of the Monroes? Are you part of the Monroe family? It's the same voice, it's the same voice. So what's your name then? Can you try and tell us your name? Did I say I'm not telling you? I'm not. If it was, that was like quite a scary voice, that. Sure, that said run. So. Bro, look at it. Wow. Wow, it's like someone touching it. This is, this is mental. Is that you doing that? If that's you doing that, can you, can you try and say, it's me? Carl, what's moving that eagle book? Look at the book moving. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's like the page, yo, it's like the page is like turning over, bro. So if that's you, can you move no, the book? it's waving. It's waving, yeah. Yeah, look at that. Can you close the book? Close the book. Bro, what kind of trying to, mate? Close Bro, the book. Bro, trying to. Go and try and use all of our energy right now and close the book. If that's you doing that, close the book now. Bro, look at it. Weird that. Keep going. Can you close the book? Bro, it's pausing slowly. Slam it shut. If you must. If you must. Yeah. Do it. Do it. Oh my god. Yo, look at it. It's bouncing. Do it. Bro. Do it. 
Do it. Man, why is it doing that? It's going back and forth. It's not. It's closing ever so slightly. Do you want me to turn this off? I'll tell you what, I'm, I'm going to turn this off and we're going to use a different device and we're going to talk to us out loud. Bro, 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 that just shot up. The numbers just moved on that and the temperature's fluctuating up and down. It's been stuck at 20 degrees perfectly and now it's just been flying to 20.8, 21 point summit, back down to 20, back down to 20.5, back up to 21 point summit. Now it's just sat at 20.5. And the it, thing's stopped, it, that's massive, stopped. If there's a big difference, like, it'll light up orange. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. There was there was loads of numbers on the middle. Have you got a fall? And then that started it's fluctuating. Just to show that the light comes on. Yeah, it's just going to Yeah, but it's not doing. I might have to run it and ring you. Yo, bro. Yo. How bizarre is this? Mental, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, watch this. <sighs> well, just leave it because it actually did go up a bit then when you tried to show me. Um, and just to show you what happens when you come close to this. Well, you, you see, right it, you have to be right on it. You have to be literally touching it to set it off. Which is pretty freaky, really. I wonder if it's worth moving upstairs away from the frozen shot. This yeah. Beast yeah. Try it in my bedroom. Yeah, come on then. Yeah, come on then. <laughs> Are we bringing this eagle book? Yeah. But it was, it, I didn't even have, oh yeah, I did. It was the eagle. When we had these two books, so I'll just take these. Well, let's take this with us. Are you taking this as well? Let's take the eagle book. Sense, uh, bird of prey watching people. Bird enthusiast. Bird of prey enthusiast. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, you, this, high, high times it actually says observing. it actually <laughs> says that the Falls Castle is the ancient home of the chiefs of Clan of Monro. So basically, they've they've always been chiefs, whatever that means. Wow, it's real cold in here. I know. Oh, bro. Real cold in here. Look at this bed though. You sit a wrap up near the door, so that is such a big bed, isn't it? It may, it look, all three of us sat on it and it's tiny still. Yeah. Oh, look at this. It's not even a double bed, it's a quad bed. <laughs> I don't get it, back in the day they didn't even have baths and stuff, but they had beds this big. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's freaky because that's the castle, it's delicious. Yeah, it is. Crazy, oh, hang on, no. How can it be? It can't be. That's just outside. So no, because yeah, the castle's like that. The way, castle's there. Open and open. I tried to open it earlier. It might have been an old balcony or something, or an old bit of the building. We'll walk out and have a look, but it's definitely not. It's definitely not a castle you saw, mate. They want to hear us from in here. What the hell? What is that? What is this chair? Is that a real tree? What is this? God damn it. Alright, let's, uh, let's do some more EVP stuff so we can get anything. Yo, yo, we, you, you asked me a couple questions, bro. Like what? Right, I'm gonna hold it and you ask the question, yeah? He'd probably like me. Did you hear how it replied? Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. right, I'll, I'll hold it and then you, you ask it. Go on then. Right. Um, right, I can't think of the names again. Let me just get the names up. Just between questions, just like leave a gap there. Yeah. We'll do like three questions. Uh, I, right. Um, leave like a 10 second gap. The place was called, it was referred to as something like mad, something in Scottish that were mad that read out to Donald's land. And the only Donald I can find in the history was the very first person in 1039. 
traditional founder of the ancient house of Mamra. So he founded this house in 1039. Wow. This grounds. So maybe there was a settlement here before, so it might be him that we're looking for. Oh no, there's two Donald Monroe's, but the other the other guy's only in uh, 1195. Supposed to have built the old Tower of Falls, so the old tower. So shit, it dates back to 1039. There were people living on this site. That's insane. Man. And the first bit of the tower, the first bit of the old tower that's... Whoa. Whoa. It's weird, man. It's just, every just time be, we speak about the just house. Just before that went off, it, oh, no joke, if I, I got all the static on my leg. Um, listen, it, um, I keep feeling that, but I thought it was just me getting shivers. Um, yeah, back to what I was saying. He was supposed to have built the first bit of the tower, which is probably that bit that they said was 14th century. Mm. But back here, it doesn't. It says it's 11th century. No, it said the tower was 11th century. Didn't oh, it? did it? Yeah, it said yeah. Right. The place is 14th. Right, well, that fits in then with what it said, because then that guy came in 1490 and mm -hmm. built the rest. Mm -hmm, that's right. But from from the time the tower was built in 11 in 1195, it's mad because the first guy who owned it was called Donald, Donald, and then the next guy who actually made the tower was called Donald. And then um so bloodlines keep the same names. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, but that's what it is. It's Donald George Hugh Robert Donald Robert George Robert George George Robert Hugh George John William Hector <laughs> Robert Robert Hector Robert Hector 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 Robert John. Do you know what I mean? They all are the same names. So that it, we should be able to get at least one of them. Right. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna run this now and just ask a couple of questions. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Everyone ready? Right, I'm, I'm running now. Is Don is Donald here with us? Are any of the Monroe family here with us? Can't think of it. I can't think of anything off here. Oh, I couldn't think, man. I couldn't. DJ's I went blank then. All <laughs> <laughs> right, what's that? That's it there. Are any of the Monroe family here with us? Nothing on there, man. Hmm. Bizarre, isn't it? So if you're here with us now, can you try and say something out loud to us? Wait, man. Has this one been in the back bedroom? Well, Did you go in the back bedroom before, were you? No. I turned I turn all the lights off. All the lights off on the back, back, back bedroom. Whoa! Bro, that's touching it. Yeah, me. That is touching it. Yeah. That's what it did when I touched it a minute ago. Bro, I 100%, 1000%, I walked down there and it turned Why is that little? Light turn, off, did you turn that light on, Jess? Or not? Bro, look. Did you turn the light on then? Put that next to it. Didn't you? Turn it off. Turn the light off. Yo. That's something touching it. That's full on touching it. Mate. That's insane. And like the walls are so thick. That windowsill that you can see up there, that's how thick the walls are. Every single wall is that thick. That doorway is not an empty doorway. This is how the wall it is, so you can't get interference with things. Oh yeah, I can feel the I can feel oh yeah, I can feel the breeze coming through this door. You can feel the breeze from the outside. That's definitely an outside door that. It'll have been something to bring stuff in, like goods and that, on it. So if that was you, can you try and turn that light off? Try and turn that light off if you can. I'd love if that turned on. <laughs> I don't think Sam and Jess would. Uh, I'd sleeping in his bunk bed, mate. <laughs> he tried and knock on something. What was that? What that? was that? Yeah, what did you just hear that? Where did that come from?
you knock up those drawers again. If you can't do that, can we hear your voice? What was that? No, that was like something moving in the drawers again. Really? Open the drawers, bro. Open the drawers. It's weird because it sounded like it came from down the bottom of the corridor. Right, well, I, I might have just heard the echo because I had my hood up, but I swear it sounded like something scratched in these drawers. There's claws in here and stuff. What is that? <laughs> That's a bit freaky. And like, look guys, look how close I am to this REM pod and it's not even reacting to me being here. And it's got like that creepy old paper in the bottom of it. Well, there's no, there's no that could be possibly making a scratching noise in here. Is that your voice? We can hear you. Shh. Footsteps. Listen. You didn't hear that, bro. Did you just hear that? There's footsteps. I can Not hear. the footsteps. No one fucking heard that. Wow. Something went. See? Is that you? Oh, no. Sorry. Go and check downstairs because I'm telling you how someone's down there. I bet that's that woman. There's no other explanation. That was someone walking down. The door's locked, though. We'd have heard her open it. It yeah, creaks when you open it. No, not necessarily, because there is other entrances downstairs. There's two ways in. Yeah, but we'd have heard them open when you opened yeah, that front door. It's down. loud as anything. There was a female voice as well. Like, I think like about it, if she's, if she's walked down the drive or anything like that, seeing, you know, everything's in darkness, but these lights shining around, it kind of looks a bit... Nah, she would have opened the door. Like, like, she, she, would, she would have turned the lights on that. She would have shouted. Yeah, yeah. She would have shouted. She, she wouldn't be walking around. She can't just she walk in anyway. We could hardly hear her from downstairs. Hello? You can come in. How about you come join us? Footsteps, bro. Footsteps, bro. On the wood floor, innit? On the wood floor, yeah. Ah, that's what I heard, mate. Downstairs? No, it sounded like it was walking in here. Upstairs. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. right outside that door. Can you make another sound for us? Is this your castle? It's funny how the room pods are not going off now, mm -hmm. aren't they? Yeah. I know, and I'm stood right next. Should I move in case it's me? It's like the energy's like going to move into the stuff like that, like more audio kind of style, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But I could, I was telling you now, that light was not on, mate. It was 100% not on. Well, maybe we go and turn it off and see if it comes back on. Yeah, yeah, I'll go do it now. I'm going to come down there and I'm going to turn this Wow, do you know what's weird? When Carl walked out there then, mm -hmm. they rattled exactly the same as that noise. No and where way. did we hear them footsteps coming from? Look, watch. But give me that. Listen, listen to the drawers. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, I banged then. Wait till Carl walks back in because he's fatter than me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, see? Yeah, yes. when you walked in there, they rattled. So when we was hearing that noise there and there, that's what we were hearing. This is nuts. This is mad. Why are you gonna do this in my bedroom? Because yours has got the coolest bed in it. <laughs> 
Oh, Paul's the man, it's sick. Do you reckon it's actually old? But if it was really old, all them would have been hand carved, mm. wouldn't they? And it, that doesn't look hand carved. I don't know though, because they're all different. Mm, it looks... so, I've turned the light off. Can you try and turn it on again? Bro, if a light goes on now, I'm going to bed. <laughs> I'm not. I'm <laughs> oh, it's scary outside. It's that dark. Yeah. It's big. Can't see the cars unless you. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, were this that, covered that's... this time? That's loud, this one. Yeah, it was. So you like to tap on things then? How about you try and touch one of us? Come on, touch one of us. I'm gonna put my hand out. Just wait one sec, this is me. I thought that was gonna go on anything, it had a drawing thing on it. Can you touch my hand? <laughs> Everyone's just putting their hands on. <laughs> I'll try and touch one of us if you can. Rampod's dead now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, whoa. Uh, what? What the hell, man? Now that was weird. This is nuts. I was literally just like inside giving up a bit then, thought it had gone a bit quiet. <laughs> Rip <Rip-pod's> dead. <laughs> yeah, and it was a boof. Whoa. Did you see it for a little flick then? Yeah, yeah. That's like someone walked past it. Can you move it? Yeah, can you move the whole device? What else can you do? <laughs> Nothing by the sounds of it. It's like I'm, I don't know, why is it having something going over it? Or it's like a massive burst of energy or some sort. Can we hear your voice? Come on, we really want to hear your voice. You say something out loud? As loud as you can. Whoa. Well, he did it as loud as he could, mate. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, it's true. So, is this the only way you can really communicate with us? If so, can you light all the lights up again? All the way to the top? As loud as you can. Whoa. <sighs> Yo! That, that was like can, is it, can you move things? Anything? Any object? No. Well, I set the other device off. Can you touch the other device? The one with the light on. Oh, look at the temperature. It's fluctuating. Is it? What's it gone to? It's only fluctuating like 0 0.4, 0 0.3. Now it's at 18.1 and it was going up to like 18.6 and down, look, still doing it. Really? 18.4, 18.1 again. Keeps fluctuating up and back down. If you can touch this device, the other device with the green light on it, 
Can you try and move it or use all your energy to touch it? And now it's completely stopped. It's completely stopped now, mate. It's literally just sat at 18.1. I'm going to run a spirit box again. Let's see what we get. <clears throat> <coughs> Shut the fuck up. I don't know what the fuck I'm trying to do on this chat. Right, I'm going to turn this device back on again now. I want you to come through and talk to us. Is that, what the? Was that you? What was that? What? Wow. That noise? <clears throat> I'm not sure, I thought it was more like a symptom of getting knocked. Yeah, like knocked. Oh no, I, I literally just coughed, but then as soon as you switched that on, I did hear something, but as soon as you switched it on, and that, that was, was so like, enough, yeah. that was like a split second after I made that noise. Very important. Good, yeah. I'm told, so can you try and make it as clear? Wow. Can you try and... Talk as clearly as you can to us, please. Okay, you're going mad, the rent one. So do you keep setting this device off then? Yeah, it's me. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, it's me, just said, oh. yeah, it's me. Oh, no okay. way. Well, thank you very much for coming, talking to us. Do you know what that, that we're here. That mirror's creepy. Only you. Only you. That sounded like it said only you. That's weird, isn't it? So your life has been here then? That well sounded like it said two different things then. Yeah. So I think you're quite happy to talk to us and show, show us that you're around. Summit as possible, it sounded like. Possible, yeah. You try and make it as clear as possible. Use the device. Wow. That is mental, mate. <laughs> Calm. Wow. Yeah. Yes. How do you know my name? Do, do you know me or something? It's the same man. It's the same voice every time. Yeah. Yeah, it's strange, isn't it? Yeah. So what's your name then? Can you, can you try and tell us your name now? Did I say Donald? Don't, that's... Don't, something. I'm going to have to check back on the review, but... Here. I swear that said Donald. That said, uh, bro, did you hear that? It was like, Donald. And now, while wow, that was going yeah. mad. So, so it's Donald that we're speaking to. How many Donalds was there? Two. And they date back to the the very first one was called Donald. Stan. What you want to stand up? What just tapped on the bed? I heard that. Oh, you shit me up then, because I felt it in my feet. So Donald, what, what year is it? Tell me you heard that. Ah. I, I heard that, man. Oh my God. What was it? A woman going... Hmm. The only lady was that... Um... So is, is there a female here with us too? Who's the lady? The lady was called Eva Gascoigne. Is Eva Gascoigne here as well? Eva, are you here too? So who's in this room then? Is this originally a bedroom? 
grandpa. Mm. Yo, what the f was that? That was, that that was, was horrible. Screaming, man. No, mur did I say murder? He said murder, Joe. Yeah. It was murdered. My son. My son. Hang on, hang on, hang on, bro. Was it not her son that got killed in army? Bro, I'm sure it was her son that got killed in army. Let me just check. So your son was murdered? Army, army. Oh, it just said army. It is as well, just as I seen it. Just as I seen it. No. Right, so him. Oh, the rainbow's going as well. That's absolutely crazy. That just, oh just as I was about God. to say, oh, I've gone so cold. Look, bro, look, look. Shit, we have bang. It's bang on this right now. Bang on me. No way. Wow. No, listen. It was her grandson. Well, that it's got to have been because. Hang on. No, it can't have been. Because she was fourteen when he was born. She was 1881, he was 1895, so it must have been her brother, that. So it just flew straight past Carl, this? Really? really? Straight, and then the rim pod went off. No way. I think it was dust, or? I don't know, could have been. Oh, wow. That's it. it might not be Eva we're speaking to, it might be one of the other, missed, one of the wives. She might have been killed or something. So if it's not Eva, then who is it? We're fluctuating. We've just dropped from 18.1 to 17.7, 17.5, 17.4, 17.6, 17.9 again. We're fluctuating on that. Look at, and we're fluctuating on this. It's dropped from 18.1 and it's fluctuating down to 17.4 and back up again. Man, this is, this is crazy right now. And REM pod's going mad. Whoa, mate. Whoa. What? Let me turn, turn the lights off. See, what, see, you, see what you think of this. Hold on. Just watch here. Watch here. Oh, that's no, glaring it. Oh, no. Do you see that? No, it falls slow as anything. It disappeared. That was a bit watch weird, that. Comes down right here. Comes down through your light and then just drops off. Oh, yeah. Yo, what was that? Mate, rewind that. Just wanna get my camera in focus. Whoa! Whoa, that lit the room up! Wow, I expected to see someone studying one at corners then or something. Bro! I heard something then as well. It's, hard, it's really hard to see. Oh, if this route... Yo, you show my oh. when that goes off, what the hell appears on that wall? What? Turn that light off and hope that REM pod goes off again and everyone focus on that wall. Why? Just watch. Why? If that's you, set that REM pod off now again so we can see you. Yeah. Did you hear the drawers? Yo, what? what? Did you hear that? That sounded like something was fudding into the room there. There was something, Put your light on. something. Put your light on. Something stomped into the room then. Turn it on. Bro, I'm seeing, I'm seeing shit. No, seriously. Turn the fucking thing on now, bro. Bro, I hope to God that was my imagination. Bro, this is getting No, 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 no. There was someone, I could see an outline of someone still at the door. See, this is what you said with the brain. I don't know if there was a fucking lamp or what, but I freaked out then. Bro, I know I'm not shitting you, yeah? Right, I'm not sleeping in this room. When that lit up, above here, there was a shadow and there was a head inside of it. Ooh, and oh, right, mate, oh, when the light came on, this bit disappeared, but that bit could not have been this from right, that right, REM pod. Right, right, let's just sit down. I want to I want to see if we can get that. You'll sit, sit here, sit here sometime. No, I'm standing oh, over here with Dammy. Are you mad? I'm stand by. Don't, don't fucking take ages to know. Right, 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 get your phone out ready for your talk. Right, I've got, I've got the thing I'm talking Mate, about. I've gone cold. I've gone cold, mate. So if, if that's you trying to show yourself, can you do it again, please? What the hell? Do you hear that? Three knocks. 
Wow, there was a whisper then, and then the fridge came I thought, on. I thought it was a lady's voice. Oh no, I'm not, re not even recording. Ah, oh, mate, you missed that. Hello? It's the fridge, that's the fridge. No, the fridge came on after it. Let me check where, where I got to that. Did you hear that? What, the fridge came on after this? that. Just said like a whisper. And then the fridge. Yeah, I didn't see. Hear the fridge. I heard, I heard the, fridge fridge the fridge come on afterwards. Because we'd all started reacting when the fridge came on. I'm short breath now. That was funny, when it sounded like someone came in the room, that was loud. No, I heard that. It sounded like someone well, stomped I saw, in. I saw Jess freak and I looked over and it looked like a white silhouette of someone, like a, a white outline. Oh. Would it be bad if I slept with a light on tonight? No, I'm sleeping. <laughs> I'm sleeping with the light on, man. <laughs> we'll, we'll wake up in the morning, everyone will be all in one room together. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm liking this too. Mate, it's been a long time since I've, ever, I've actually felt dodgy like this, but bro, right, I thought that when that went off again, I was going to see that light up. But then when we switched all the lights off, I could see it anyway without that lighting up to cast the shadow. But then there was a thing to the side of it that appeared when that flashed, but it can't be anything from where that is. But I just thought I was tripping me. It's the, do you know what? We should have had a camera pointed at this, at this mirror all the time. At that doorway. I could see some stuff. And I, was, I was close to the door, yeah. Because it's pitch black. It's weird because it I felt quiet. like I felt a presence there as well. Mate. Felt like something was lingering in the corner, man. All right, let's, let's have a just take it. It would again. dodgy that then. That's 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 dodgy, that's mate. That <laughs> I don't know where to sit. <laughs> this is going to be one of them videos that I can't cut, like you were saying before, that no, you just no. can't cut because no one will believe you if you do. Right, let, let's just like sit here, just like not say anything, just see what happens. I'm getting my feet away from underneath this bed, mate. Oh, bed no, I've got a proper paranoid finger. If someone touched that, I'd end up going through it with me. <laughs> Honestly, I'd kill you all if someone touched that bottom. If someone nipped that or cut it, oh my God, I think I'd skits. Down that yeah, it's scary, isn't it? That's Should we shut the door? See if someone knocks on it. Yeah, right, we're shutting you out. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep him in. <laughs> yeah, I'll keep him in, whatever. Yeah. Right, if you're still in the room with us, can you set the REM pod off again? The device that you've been playing with in the middle of the room. That's me, man. Oh, shit. So, you're not in the room with us. So if you're not in the room with us, can you knock on the door? Or can you open the door? Or even just touch the handle? So what's with the eagles then? Was you involved in saving the eagles from extinction or something? Mad burst of energy. Yeah. I've noticed it was chaos then though. Everything was happening. If we've locked you out of the room, tap on the door and I'll open it back up. Uh, yeah, in fact, you know what I'll do? I won't lock it. And it, look, this door is stiff. So if that opens, that is not uh, like a cliche thing. That door is stiff. Right, if we've locked you out and you want to come back in, you're more than welcome to push the door open. What was 
Is that a creek? You hear that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it sounded like someone making the noise though. Yeah. Was it your stomach? <laughs> it did actually sound like it could have been a stomach. It was that sort of noise. Some yeah, go. Oh shit, turn on the fast. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna turn the lights off now. Are you gonna try and show us where you are? Or open the door while the light's off. I'm going to turn the lights off for, for a couple of seconds. You're going to show yourself. Chilled there, though. It yeah, he does now. It feels chilled now, yeah. yeah. Do you know, since he freaked out just then, it, it went. Yeah. We probably scared it off. Yeah, it's all that's what comes out. Yeah, I wonder if we, we scared it off or what? Like, ah! Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, if we've scared you, come back. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I thought that's what ghosts were meant to do, scare you. <laughs> what is that red thing glowing in the bottom? Yeah, it's just in for PRS. And stuff. Oh, one of them, yeah. yeah. Jesus. Weird, man, because that light had bombed the corridor. Unless it was you, Jess, being sat there that was making it all happen. <laughs> Go on, it might want you. Yeah. Or you, Sam, being on floor there. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> it might have liked the way we were. Yeah, well, back to the door, original, it? Yeah. Original arrangement again, let's see what happens. Because we was ignoring the door, weren't we? Yeah. Don't like sitting here, man. Or close yeah, the door. Back, if you don't want if if you don't want to be in here with us, Claude, push the door too. Mm. Is this actually still working? Yeah. I mean, if it's used all the energy it's can because there's, there's no more bangs, there's no more... But I'm not tired anymore. I've got more energy than I had before and I've fallen asleep. Mm. So is that all you've got for us tonight then? Or should we move to a different bit? Yeah, let's go down to the bottom end with the light. Yeah, I thought that because that's nearest to oldest bit as well. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll get this. You get that. And I'll get these just in case. Carl, you caused this trouble. You're well staying last. Yeah, to the Did someone been in that cupboard? Oh. Well, I went in it before and 100% shut that door. Oh, yeah. So unless somebody else has been in it with me, it'll be since I went in it. No, don't be saying that, bro. I'm just gonna swap my battery rapid. Right, guys, we're just gonna set up in this room and I want to check my battery out. Right, guys, we're gonna end the video there. What was you just shy and then you weirdo? I'm an animal. Un animal. Right, guys, we're gonna end it there. I hope you enjoyed it. We got some cool things through the spirit box. The REM pod was the best. It was it was activating on point then, wasn't it? Was it was crazy. Literally on command. command. There's no denying that. What do you reckon it was though? Do you reckon it was something to do with us talk what we were talking about? Possibly, about yeah. history. Do you reckon he feels that thingy about his birds, like that what do they call it? That much passion for his birds that he don't like us talking about it. Maybe or maybe it was just highlighting the fact that we are talking about the right the, thing. The actual right thing That's what the I family thought. itself and it was coming through. That's what well, I thought. No. But why do you reckon it stopped though when we all because literally it stopped. We asked it to do something and as soon as I said Watch for the REM pod to light up, never lit up again. So I think it was a massive build of, of, of energy and it was just like more things were happening and because we all freaked out, it's just like... Do you think all because we dispersed. freaked out like that, if this is real, do you think that we freaked out like that, we took its energy? Possibly, yeah. It almost because... feels, it, when you freak out, it's like 
Yeah, yeah, because listen, there. like when we was in there, we was all saying we felt static. As soon yeah. as that happened, everyone went chilled and stopped feeling all that. Yeah, so man. is that the energy being drawn from you or what? Is this what you're saying? Possibly. I'm trying to shed light on this because I don't Possibly. believe none of this shit. Is it? <laughs> yeah, are, you, are you dehydrated? Matt. What? You were dehydrated? Yeah, only because I've drunk about eight Red Bulls. And probably uh-huh. Everyone's dehydrated right now. Do you know what one of the theory is? Uh-huh. The paranormal activity, it dehydrates you. Do you know I reckon that's just because we're talking shit and we're <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> you know what I mean? And literally drying our. Is that not what we do? <laughs> What's up? What's up? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's what we do. Anyway, I'm going to end this one there, guys. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think, as always. I'm going to hit the boys up. <laughs>